So There We Have Been is based on the best-selling novel Norwegian Woods by Haruki Murakami. And the sort of the creation of that piece was very improvisation based. Uh, so James obviously read the book um, and then went through and pulled out sections of the book that really inspired him and set improvisation tasks based on that. And then the dancers had to sort of learn back their own improvisation from film. There's sort of three central characters that we really looked at, um, and one of them, sort of the lead guy, his best friend commits suicide very early on, and his best friend's girlfriend is obviously grieving and coping with the loss of her boyfriend, and their grief kind of brings them together, but they also they're falling in love. It's sort of that pulling apart and yearning, but also falling in love and really needing each other, and so part of what we were doing when we were researching that piece was wondering how to be able to show that in movement. And so we started with them on top of each other and we were dancing and moving around each other. And that sort of became a whole inspiration for the piece in that she's so dependent on him that he can't put her down and he's caring for her so much that he can't put her on the floor. So the whole piece, the whole 17, 18 minutes of the piece, uh, the female dancer doesn't touch the ground at all. nature is very, very typical of James's style and he's very interested in really high quality dancers and the way that they can really move and what the body can do. Um, within this piece we sort of, we discovered something else as well in that the human relationships is something that we really enjoy working with just because it's something that any audience member can relate to. They might not have been through that experience, but there are elements within that narrative and within those themes that people can relate to. And what you find with this piece as well is because there, there is just two of them on stage and it is, you get drawn into their world and you get drawn into that relationship. And it is a very, very emotional piece, which is something that we're maybe just starting to explore. And so it's a way of being able to sort of marry the really physical, dance style with these themes and with these emotions that then the audiences can also engage with as well. <laughs> 